How's it going everybody? So in this video, I am going to talk about why you are losing weight everywhere but your waist. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. So I've been uh, bulking and cutting. So body, I've been doing bodybuilding powerlifting for 11 years. I've done lots of cutting cycles where I've dropped more than 20 to 30 pounds in about two to three months. So I'm really, really experienced with losing weight. I'm actually currently losing weight right now. I've went from 201 pounds down to 190 in three weeks. So the reason why you're losing weight everywhere but your waist is actually super, super simple. Um, the reason why is because it takes actually quite a bit of weight loss before you start to notice it in your waist. Um, it is all dependent on your genetics. So every single person is going to have different genetics and with their different genetics, what will happen is that they will lose weight differently in different parts of their body. So me, for example, I will lose weight in my arms and my back first and my legs and my butt take a longer time to come off. Um, my abs, which is my stomach, um, my calves, um, stuff like that, that stays pretty consistent. But um, the thing is, you need to lose a lot of weight if you want to see a difference in your waist. Um, a lot of people, when they are losing the weight, they may only be losing five, six pounds. If you lose 20 to 30 pounds, you're gonna see a huge difference in your waist, absolutely huge. What I found out is the people that usually say that they're losing weight everywhere except for the waist, generally they're not losing enough weight. Eventually, if you keep losing weight, um, it will come off from your stomach. Another important thing to, to um, consider too is making sure that you're actually losing fat and not muscle. You can lose a ton of weight and it could be muscle on, and not actually body fat. This happens if you lose weight too quickly. So for example, if you start off at 200 pounds and you get down to 180 pounds in a couple of weeks, that's a 20 pound loss in a couple of weeks, that's way too fast. Um, generally two to three pounds per week of weight loss. Anything more is generally too fast. And what will happen is your body will utilize muscle. So you, if you, you lose a ton of weight, you may notice, hey, I actually look worse and then when I started, and I see this a lot of time, a lot of times people will lose weight too quickly and they'll actually lose muscle instead of fat. So that is why you're losing weight everywhere but your waist. It could be numerous different reasons. The first thing that I would do again is I would just keep track of how much weight you have lost and how quickly you have done it in. So for example, if you've only lost five pounds and you notice you still have a big waist, lose more weight, lose 15, 20, 25 pounds, and then have a look at your waist. But when you're doing this, you have to do it slowly, two to three pounds per week. If you're doing it fast, you've lost 20 pounds in a couple of weeks and you still have a big waist, that could be because you have lost the weight too quickly and you're not losing weight, you're actually losing muscle. So just keep that in mind, you guys. So end of video, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg 999 Thank you.